Number 11. I'm going to show you two ways to do number 11. The first way will be the long way. Okay, so they said which expression is equivalent or equal to x squared minus 17x minus 60? Well, I'm going to have to do these one by one. So let's go ahead and do a. I have x minus 20 and x plus 3. Okay, and I'm going to have to do the arrows. I'm going to have to foil, multiply. So I'm going to do x times x after, again, x times positive 3 negative 20 times x and negative 20 times 3. So I'm going to do x times x plus x times positive 3 plus negative 20 times x plus negative 20 times 3. x times x is x squared, I have two x's, plus x times 3 is 3x, three negative 20 times x is negative 20x, negative 20 times 3, if you put that in the calculator, one, oops, negative 20, so parenthesis, negative 20, parenthesis, parenthesis, 3, parenthesis, negative 60. Okay, and then always the two in the middle are like terms. I have x and x, so I will copy x squared, 3 minus 20, 3 minus 20, negative 17, so negative 17, x minus 60. Okay, so this is what I got here for a. Is this the same? Oh, it's the same. Excellent. So my answer is A. Okay. Now, if you want to check, let me show you how you can check. Okay. You're going to need your calculator. All righty. So you're going to push on one. No. Go to two. I want the graph. Okay. Let's put this one in the calculator. So that is x squared. So let's see. x squared minus 17x minus 60, enter, okay, and this is what I got. Let's go to the table, control T, and let's pick some points for this, just to check. This is the easy way. I'll pick three points. Okay, so one is with negative 76, okay, two is with negative 90, 3 is with negative 102. Okay? Now I'm going to check the points for A. All right. So, control, doc. I want 2. I want the graph. And I'm going to put parenthesis x minus 20, parenthesis. And then again, parenthesis x plus 3, parenthesis. Enter. Oops. Enter. Okay. And I'm going to do control T. I want the table. So control T. Control T. I get a table. Let's check the points. Is 1 with negative 76? Oh, yay. Is 2 with negative 90? Yes. Perfect. Is 3 with negative 102? Yes. Perfect. So I'm 100% sure A is my answer. Let's do B just to check, and we need some extra practice, right? So let's go ahead and do B. Okay, so B, just to practice, x minus 5 times x minus 12. I'm going to do my arrows here. So I'm going to do x times x, x times negative 12, negative 5 times x, and negative 5 times negative 12. So I'm going to do x times x, so these two, plus, again, x times negative 12, plus negative 5 times x, plus negative 5 times negative 12. x times x is x squared, x times negative 12, negative 12x, 
negative 5 times x is negative 5x, and negative 5 times negative 12 is positive 60. The two in the middle are like terms, so copy x squared. Negative 12 minus 5, if you put in the calculator, is negative 17x, and copy plus 60. Now let's check. Is this the same like this one? No, because here it's a plus. I want minus, so this is not correct. So let's go ahead and check in the calculator just to see if the points are correct, which we know will be wrong, right? So control doc, go to the graph, two, and let's put this, let's put this one, B, in the calculator. Okay, so parenthesis, x minus 5, parenthesis, parenthesis, x minus 12, parenthesis, enter. Okay, and let's go to the table. So control T is 1 with negative 76? No, it's with the 44. So that's not what I want. So no. So B is not correct. Okay, let's go ahead and check C just for extra practice. C, we got x minus 20 times x minus 3. We're going to do x times x, x times negative 3, negative 20 times x, and negative 20 times negative 3. So I'm going to do x times x, these two, plus ne x times negative 3, plus negative 20 times x, and plus, and then negative 20 times negative 3. x times x is x squared. x times negative 3 is negative 3x. Negative 20 times x is negative 20x. Negative 20 times negative 3 is positive 60. We're going to do the two like terms in the middle. So x squared, negative 3 minus 20 is negative 23x, copy plus 60. Is this the same? No, because this is negative 23 and this is a plus. So this is not what I want, no. And let's check it in the calculator just to make sure. So we're going to check C here. So new page, control, doc, and let's put 2. All right, so parenthesis x minus 20, parenthesis, parenthesis x minus 3, parenthesis enter. Okay, control T. Is 1 with negative 76? No, it's with 38. So this is no good. So C is no good. Okay, let's just check D with the calculator. So with the calculator again, so control doc. I want the 2, I want the graph, 2, and let's go ahead and put D in the calculator just to check it. So parenthesis x plus 5, parenthesis, parenthesis x minus 12, parenthesis, enter. Let's make a table, so control T, control T. Okay, is 1 with negative 76? No. This one is with negative 66, so this is not correct, too. So my answer is A, 100%.